Mexican police officers, afraid to show their faces, paraded one of their most wanted and brutal drug lords, handcuffing him for the cameras. Known as La Barbie for his fair complexion, Edgar Valdez Villarreal was once a high school football player in Laredo, Texas. Now he's accused of trafficking a ton of cocaine each month and gruesome scenes like this. Headless bodies hanging from a bridge, a warning to his drug-running rivals. Experts now expect a fight to replace him. Over the next 48 to 72 hours, there could be an uptick in violence as a result of his capture. In the past nine months, Mexican authorities killed two other major drug lords, a coup for embattled Mexican president Felipe Calderon. But Calderon's crackdown is thought to actually be making the violence worse because cartels are splintering and power struggles erupting. In the past week, 14 people were found dead near Acapulco. Two Mexican mayors were killed and 72 migrants were found dead 100 miles south of Texas, the worst mass killing in the drug wars. Mexico's president says the cartel threat, quote, has to be met head on, but they'll be doing it with fewer police officers. Yesterday, 3,200 of them were fired because of corruption. Many were working for the cartels. You either go over to the dark side and work with them, or you get out of the business. A tough choice in a place with few good options. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Los Angeles.